What's going on guys, ZBreezan here, and today we're going to be having a look at Ark once again. Now our T-Rex out here, the Hecrex that we picked up, has been on a little date and we have a fertilized egg. So today we're going to hatch that bad boy and we'll see how we go. Hopefully we can get a female and then we can get some incest going and we'll get plenty more T-Rexes where that one come from. So that's the plan for today anyway, and we also want to set up a little bit of electricity as well because it's see at the moment we're living pretty primitive. But if we come into here, we'll see this egg. So this is the egg I'm talking about here. So it's from a 260 and a 279, which is pretty good. Uh, I hope it's female, but it doesn't really say. And we are going to take that guy. Hopefully not eat it. I have in the past eaten the eggs, which is not very good at all. And what we're going to do is set up some campfires. Now, I don't need, know if it needs heat, but we're going to find out. That is for sure. So we're going to take this guy, and we're actually going to go up the top here. I just think it's going to be a little easier to go up the top. These things are pretty cool, but they are pretty messy. They're not like perfect landers or anything by any means, but there we go, we're up top. So I have spent a little bit of time as well to help together some heaters. So we've got some heaters here. What we do need though is we need some wood. So let's go get some wood real quick. But yeah, this guy's grouse to get around. I really enjoy it with this one. Uh, let's get some wood here. But hopefully it doesn't take too long and hopefully it needs heat. Uh, not cold. I was going to set up the air conditions, but I don't know if they do heat or not. So let me know. That would be nice, but I'm pretty sure we're going to need heat. So I've got these fireplaces going. Let's get a little bit more wood here. All right, so now we've got that wood, we can start setting up here. So let's try and grab some heaters off this guy. How many can we hold? Can we hold eight? Yes, we can hold eight, so we're going to go with eight here. Yep, pack comes in handy, especially when you get jammed between walls like that. All right, so we're going to put a couple down, and hopefully we don't need them all. But there's plenty of room up here if we do need them. So we're going to shove that guy there. That one there. There we go. Nice and even, just because I like it like that. Beautiful. So let's grab some wood here. Put this away. Uh, come over here. But that is looking pretty good. Maybe we can chuck this egg on the ground and see what it needs. Now, don't eat it. Oh, it's a drop. Hey, there we go. Nice big egg. Well, that's huge. All right, so what have we got here? Spoils in egg health incubation 100%. So I think we're good. I think we're good. But the health is going down. Health is going down fast. Too cold. All right, just seeing that then. All right, so let's get some wood here. That's going to be too much. That's going to be just right. And let's chuck that in there. That should be enough for that guy. And this one here. Yeah, we're getting things down here. All right, let's have a look at that. Too hot. Way up far. Too hot. Here we go. So it looks like it's going to take absolutely ages. One hour to incubate, which is a very long time. <laughs> So in the meantime, hopefully that is all good. And what we're going to do is actually go and do some of this electricity. I can't believe it's only one fire. We overdid it just a little bit there. That's right. It's good to be prepared. 
overly prepared than actually it's needed. So we're going to chuck that there and we're going to try and do some electricity. Make sure that is still good. I'm going to keep coming back just to make sure that is good. Uh, so with the electricity, we'll probably put it upstairs, I'm thinking, and then run the wires from that. So if we have a look in this bad boy, if we come down to the parts we've made, you can see we've got a generator there, and we have a fridge, and we have everything else to go with it, all the wiring. Hopefully that's all the wiring we need. Just like that, and we'll take that guy as well. So there we go. We got this guy there. Pretty good. Uh, let's put some of these stuff down so we can start working with it. Uh, the straight ones there, we've got splits. We've got the one that comes down, so that's all good. And we've got these junctions here. I think that is good. Let's just chuck them all down and just see how we go. Definitely gonna have to build something else, but for now that is pretty good. So where I want to put this in, um, let's go over in this corner. Now it's PVE, so I don't have to worry about hiding it and all that jazz. Uh, let's duck down, of course, ducking down works. Uh, that's looking pretty good. How do we want this? In? I want it like that. There we go. Awesome. Uh, so let's have a look at this, where we're going to sit this. So it's going to go right there, which is pretty good, I would say. And then from that, we want to go sideways, I would say. All right, guys, so how we set up this electricity, you can see here, we've gone up here, and we ran all the way out to down here. And then that comes downstairs over here and pops through the floor there. And then we've got our little connector there, which is connected to this guy here. So that is all connected together and you can open it up from the here. And we're all good. And it's all connected. So we've got the power going. Now with the magic of editing, this egg is actually nearly done. So let's go have a look at that. Uh, it did need two fires, now it's gone back down to one fire, but we have five minutes and 20 seconds to go. And then this bad boy should be hat, so very exciting news, but we're just going to wait that short little time. And we'll see how we go for now. We're probably just going to go get some meat, so we'll be back in like four minutes. Alrighty then guys, here we go. Just 30 seconds left, as you can see there. Let's just take a moment to have a look at this egg, because this egg is absolutely beautiful. I love the tech eggs. How nice is that? Especially the red one too. I think that's really cool. But here we go. 18 seconds, counting down. Everyone here looks really excited. This guy's got a bit of a sad face going on, but I'm sure he's excited inside. And the sun's come out for this crazy event. So let's get into it. Three, two, one. Boom. Do it. <laughs> hey, there he is. Awesome. Let's, let's implant this guy. Now he is my baby. Very nice too. At 56 as well. Really cool. Let's have a look. It is another male. So now we've got two males. We're going to have to try and breed again to get another female. But then we can breed the female with this guy because he is pretty cool. When I level him up as well, he's going to be crazy. So right now, I'm sure he needs food. So let's dump some food into him. There we go. There he's pretty empty. You can only take 12 pieces at a time. But have a look at him. Let's turn this guy off. Don't need that on anymore. In fact, we'll pick all these guys up. There he is. He's got the red eyes, which looks really cool. He is looking mad. I love the silver back. He's got the green on him as well, which is pretty cool, and black. Oh, we can go have a look at his dad, see what his dad looks like. All right, so his dad's here. What's his dad? He's got the silver back and the green and the black. He's very similar, but he's got a bit of blue in him as well. I know he's got the red eyes as well. They're very similar to his dad there. 
Is he following me too? I didn't realize. Let's see if he needs more food. Yeah, he's on eight. Sixty. Haha, <laughs> beautiful. Alright, let's see if he'll move over here. He's trying to move. You guys platypus is in the way. It's a platypus, but it's more like a platypus glider. Then I'm above. You can hear his little footsteps. He sounds like a monster, <laughs> but he's tiny. That is really cool. He's got the blue and everything. He looks just like his daddy. Very cool. Uh, here in four hours. God damn, son. Gotta be invested into this kid. There's 80 food. Uh, we can give him some health. Bang. Heal up, buddy. She is healing up, which is really nice. Hey. But that is pretty cool. So I'm probably going to leave it there, guys. But next episode, we are going to have this guy fully grown. And I'm definitely going to try and get a female one. So we're probably going to breed him once again. And then see where we go from there. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. It's been pretty cool. It's always good to have a little dude in action. I love his little footsteps. He sounds like he's a big dude, but he's only got little feet. <laughs> But yeah, I'm going to leave that there, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I am Z Free Zone, and I will catch you guys next time. See you.